Yeah, it's, um, you know, it's obviously very challenging news. Um, uh, from my from my vantage point, when he got hit, um, you know, I obviously knew that, that something was definitely wrong. But I uh, feel for, for Chu, uh, the fourth time this year of uh, significant uh, time on the disabled list. And uh, I mean, um, he's such a key part of this this ball club and this organization, and uh, just you feel terrible for uh, for him personally, and um, obviously, uh, you know, my it's a it's a gut punch, but you know, one that you know we're we're going to be challenged with, but uh, we got to continue to play. Martin Perez tonight, seven strong, and seemed to be using the changeup quite a bit. Where did that come from? Well, he's <clears throat> last couple times the, the change last last alley the changeup was uh, kind of a feature pitch for him. I think more confidence with it, the ability to use it in all counts. Um, I think set up with the ability to throw the fastball up, the fastball down, the changeup down, and then be able to use the the breaking ball. Uh, when he wanted to, um, obviously early on the uh, the play at first base uh, allowed the first hitter of the game, Simeon, to get on, and then uh, gave up the run there. I felt like he battled well, got a couple strikeouts in that inning, uh, but two out uh, hit by Butler that allowed the run to score, and then the the home run was just a uh, a, a pitch that looked like they were trying to go away, left it inner part of the plate, and Healy uh, put a good swing on it, was up. Uh, but after that, really settled in and, and, and took control of the game, uh, nine ground ball outs, a couple of double play balls that, uh, you know, something that we've, we've seen when when Martin is, is on, you see the ground balls, you see the the, um, the ability to, to turn a double, get a double play ball when he, when he needs it. And I think really, the ability to use the changeup, which allowed the, the swing and miss, you know, it had the six strikeouts tonight. I don't know if that's if that is a season high, but somewhere close. Jeff, how big a challenge has the leadoff spot been for you during those times when you haven't had Chu? Well, it's uh, listen, it's it's a challenge just not having Chu in the lineup, uh, whether it's a leadoff spot or not. I mean, he, the professional at bat, the ability to get on the, the on base. Uh, the, the power threat also from the leadoff spot. Uh, obviously, that changes the, the, the structure of our lineup somewhat. Uh, we'll, we'll need to need to find someone that can solidify that leadoff spot for us. Just how much of an influence has Jonathan Lucroy been on Perez now that he's caught him twice? Well, I, I think that uh, Jonathan is obviously for you know a pro behind the plate, uh, exceptional at, at his craft and the study and uh, preparation. Uh, I, I think the the thing that Jonathan does uh, is pays attention to what uh, each individual pitcher has uh, that night and and utilize it uh, to their best ability, and so. I mean, the influence, I, I think, comes with the confidence to, to be able to, to throw what, what Jonathan is asking these guys to, to throw in any, any uh, given count. And so that is, I think that is a huge plus. Um, and then just the preparation that he does based on uh, his video work and, and study of, of individual hitters. All right. Elvis broke the scoreless streak. Beltring got the grand slam. What, what did you see from your hitters tonight? Well, uh, look, Detweiler, <clears throat> obviously a little bit different than, than what we, we saw him when he was here um, in a sense that uh, he was able to land the off-speed pitch for, for strikes. Um, you know, the fastball was still uh, a bit of a challenge for, for Det, uh, the consistency of being able to get it in the strike zone. And you look up at the board, and he, he, was, close to, he was close to 50% ball strikes. Um, uh, at one point, the, the the fastball ball strike ratio was right at 50, percent and 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 so being able to, to to dial in on on any kind of velocity was a challenge early. But once uh, they saw him twice, they were able to kind of lock in, see the secondary stuff, and 
and really uh, made him pitch, uh, didn't chase balls out of the zone. Felt like our, our approach, once they, once they got through the lineup the one time, saw it became uh, very problematic for, for Debt. For that, and uh, and then obviously the a great at bat by by Elvis being able to get a pitch up out over the plate, drive it to right field to to drive the run in, and and then I think more than anything else was our ability to kind of push the line a, a along and, and not take big swings, uh, just kind of pass the baton mentality until we we had him in a spot and we got the big man to the plate and and he did the rest with with the grand slam so just another another chapter in in uh AB's career with with this ball club of coming up huge in in big spots